Under my plans, we would start paying down the debt in three years' time. So I'm not putting it on the never-never. I would start paying it down but, but in three Liz, years. That, Liz, that's uh, simply not right. You promised me, almost £40 me, you, billion you, pounds of unfunded tax cuts, but, £40 billion pounds more borrowing. That is the, company, the country's credit card. It's our children and grandchildren. Everyone here is that kids. Is, that we're is going to have true. to pick up the tab for that. Rishi, that is not true. there's nothing conservative about doing Under that. my plans, we would start paying down the debt in three years' time. And we need to get a grip of inflation. 尽管两人在英国经济、税收和脱欧等问题上各持己见，但谈到中国问题，两位候选人都积极证明自己的对华政策更强硬。We should, we absolutely should be cracking down on those types of companies, and we should be limiting the amount of technology exports we do to authoritarian regimes. I don't think it's inevitable that China will be the biggest economy in the world. In fact. We've been enabling that to happen, but I'm very clear. You know, after the appalling abuses in Xinjiang, after the terrible actions on Hong Kong, and the most recent outrage, which is China working with Russia and essentially backing them in the appalling war in Ukraine, we have to take a tougher stance. We have to learn from the mistakes we made of Europe becoming dependent on Russian oil and gas. We cannot allow that to happen with China. And freedom is a price worth paying. 最后，两人都表示，无论谁获胜，都将坚持保守党的价值观，支持英国政府。Thing I think you should work on, and I want to work on this with you. And if I win, I would love you uh, to be part of my team. Uh, is taking more risks and being bolder, because I think that's what we need to do. As a country, okay. as Prime Minister, I'll take a very, very robust view on making sure that we do stand up for our values and we protect ourselves against those threats, because that's the right thing to do for our security. 新唐人记者陈越综合报道。